If we think of epidemiology, and especially when it comes to foodborne illness, as the shoe leather detectives. We represent patients who have been seriously injured. At Marler Clark, having me as the on-staff epidemiologist has enabled the attorneys to clearly distinguish who is a legitimate case of foodborne illness and who is not. We do not need or want to take frivolous claims. We typically only take cases that have laboratory confirmation of a foodborne illness, and it must be investigated by health departments. That goes a long way in proving a case, especially when there's been an, an outbreak, a foodborne illness outbreak, or even in isolated cases, we typically require that there be health department investigation. If you have been seriously injured with a foodborne illness, it's important to document what you consumed in the three to 10 days before you became ill. If symptoms persist, you should see your doctor. If you have a child who continues to have diarrhea and, and it turns bloody, definitely contact the pediatrician about the child's illness. We also advocate contacting health departments. If you feel that you have a foodborne illness, especially from a commercial establishment, report it to your local health department. That way they can keep track of your complaint. And if other complaints come in, then they will conduct an investigation at the facility. I think that people come to Marler Clark in order to get answers that they have been unable to get elsewhere. They also seek to recover damages when they've been seriously ill. For most of us, when we have a foodborne illness, we may miss a day of work. We may miss two days of work. But for people who have been hospitalized, who have long-term consequences of foodborne illness, or even have lost a loved one, or you know, have become seriously injured, they come to us to help them, first of all, find out the source of their illness, find out what caused it, and to seek compensation for the damages in this, the illnesses that they have incurred. Mm -hmm.